Hi viewers, welcome to Shami Cooking Mantra. Today I am going to make pundu kolapu, which is very famous in Tamil Nadu, and uh, it's very commonly used, and now uh, everybody likes it. So many people it's favorite, and it's very good for health. Uh, it has some minimum ingredients, and it is made very easy, and it's made with tamarind paste and spices, and going to use the oil, and then I'm going to make it paste. A fresh paste, no chili powder, and I'm going to make a paste of no chili and coriander seeds. So let's make this up for garlic and First, we'll make the masalas. Make it a paste. Little sesame oil. Add onion. About uh, medium sized onions to chop. It's getting brown. At this point, should add dhania that is coriander seeds one spoon of methi seeds one spoon of jeera not more than that little coriander about handful of coriander Red chilies, you can add more red chilies also. I have added about 10 red chilies, which is not much spicy. Roast it for about uh, 3 to 4 minutes after you add dhania, that is coriander. So I am turning off. Let it cool and we have to make it a paste. Okay? Put it in a blender and make it a fine paste with not much water. If you want this to be less spicier, you can reduce chili and add one or two spoons of grated coconut to this when you make a masala in a blender. That is a paste. Add two spoons of grated uh, coconut. That will be little different. It will reduce the spice in this curry. So when you make for kids, you can add two spoons of grated coconut when you make a paste. Keep it aside. Let it cool and make it as a paste. So I made a paste uh, with a blender with little water, not much. So it should be this much thick. Should be like this, not watery, so that the spice will have that flavor. Because this tamarind paste is about one handful of tamarind, that is maybe a, it will be a tomato size. Uh, I have squeezed it and uh, filtered it. Now I am going to make it a boil. It has to uh, cook for about boil about uh, ten minutes minimum. So that uh, the raw flavor in this tamarind will go. So add little turmeric powder. 
let's saute this garlic first we need to temper this add ginger oil balsamic oil about uh, it, it will be about 7 uh, or 8 spoons you can add more than that it will be nice mustard seeds methi seeds already i have added in the paste so i'm adding one spoon of methi seeds to that uh, the mustard seeds are not getting brown then it become uh, bitter add garlic to the oil i have added mustard seeds methi seeds and then garlic add salt so that it will turmeric powder and then the paste paste we have made with chilies coriander seeds methi seeds and jeera So I can break this. So I can add tamarind now. Tamarind is good. Just now it will be ready. Should have. Susan is lower of flavor. Switching off. Then I'm adding to this. Keep it in sim, in a very really low flame. for 10 minutes the more it uh, is in sim the more the taste will be I'm adding curry leaves to extract the flavor little water Then adding little oil. 
un spunto da Damioli. One minute, just right. Well, it's ready to serve. Try this garlic uh, curry. Uh, it's very nice. Uh, it's very good for health. Kumbakonambu uh, is a favorite for some people. Garlic. For blood pressure, it reduces cholesterol. Try this and comment to Shami Kuti and subscribe.